Okay, welcome back to our YouTube channel, guys. How's everyone's holiday? Um, we hope you had a great Thanksgiving. Uh, we did. It was small but brief. And um, so we're back now. And tonight's video, um, I'm just kind of just kind of put it out there. Um, why I haven't been around and posting lately is because uh, I've been very, very sick. And uh, I've actually been had an illness for quite some time now. Uh, when I was 23, I'm just gonna come out and say it. So when I was 23, I was diagnosed with basically a uh, Kronos disease. And I've been dealing with that for, you know, now I'm 40. So during that time, I was taking medication. The first medication I believe was called Asacol. Uh, after that was called Lialda. Now it was called Misalamine. And um, for those of you who don't know what Kronos disease is, um, it's like irritable bowel syndrome. So basically it's kind of like you have an ulcer there and you tend to bleed. And uh, sometimes it happens when you eat certain foods or if you stress too much or if you do drink alcohol too much or, you know, anything, anything, you know. So uh, like I said, I take medication for that. And this medication that I was taking was no longer working, had no effect on me whatsoever. So uh, I went to my doctor and uh, they prescribed me some prednisone to where they could find a different medication. And they got me on this other new medication, but uh, it was, it's a popular one that's on TV. And uh, I wasn't real familiar with this medication. You know, I just seen certain reviews about it saying that, uh, you know, people had some good outcomes. You know, they didn't have any, no flare ups, no uh, abdominal pain. Um, the symptoms you would have from Crohn's disease, you know, you guys could look that up. So I was on this medication for, oh my gosh, not even two weeks. I started around late October and uh, instantly, instantly I started feeling um, symptoms. So I was getting headaches, waking up middle night with headaches, um, very intense back pain, like lower back um, to the point where when me and Z were trying to take the kids trick or treating, um, I actually had to stop and sit down, you know, and my mom showed up. You know, we continued on for a little bit, but then I ended up wanting to go home because my back was just hurting so bad. And, you know, I'm not old and I stay in shape. Uh, my job is very physical. So, I mean, I'm able to bend over to tie my shoes, no problem. So, you know, for that to happen to me was a big kind of wake up like, hey, what's going on here? But I really didn't think nothing of it. I just thought maybe, hey, I kind of overworked myself that day at work or something. Yeah, who knows? So uh, I continued on. And then um, I noticed that, you know, I was just feeling nauseated, feeling nauseous. I was losing my sense of mobility, balance, basically. And in my line of work, you know, my job, I need my balance. If not, you know, I can fall off the building. So <clears throat> I was like, something's not right here. So I look at the medication and, you know, um, I called the company and I went over, went over it with them, you know, what my symptoms were. And they, you know, they documented all this and that. And I told him to report back to my doctor, and I did. And uh, my doctor just told me, just stop the medication immediately. Just stop it, you know? Because at this time, I would feel it was doing more harm than good. Um, and not only that, I was just so tired. Oh my God, just so, so tired. I had like no energy whatsoever. You know, usually I'm able to stay up till at least midnight, but I, I was having a hard time making it till 10.30, you know? Falling asleep on the couch. Um, <laughs> Yeah, and like I said, that's not like me. That's not like me at all. So along that, I had weight loss, severe weight loss. Um, you know, I don't know if you guys can see, but you know, I've lost some weight, quite a bit of weight. I've had a lack, lack of appetite, um, just low energy all around. You know, and that's that's not like me at all. And uh, further on, I after, you know, once I stopped this medication, I still started having back pain, and. Um, having headaches still. So when I called my doctor, you know, they were like, okay, obviously this isn't right. Obviously still something's going on. So they had me do some follow-ups. They got me seeing a specialist on Tuesday, you know, for my liver, they're gonna check that out um, because my liver enzymes were off, I guess. And uh, they wanna do my, give me a brain scan. So I had an MRI done. I've had two MRIs in the past week, you know, for my brain today. And that brain was, it was like 40 minutes they had me in this thing, man. Oh gosh, I'll tell you, it was not fun, not fun. But um, the thing is, is that, you know, I'm showing early signs of, of, you know, 
possible. They say P what's called, I didn't know, even heard of this disease. It's called PML, you know, which is like a minor case of brain cancer. And, and it could be, you know, brain cancer too. You know, they're both kind of related in the same ballpark. So anyway, all the symptoms that I've been having are related to this. So they just want to do a brain uh, MRI to make sure that I'm cool, that I'm clear. I'm in the green, you know, I'm, I'm okay. You know, because if I'm in the red, then it's, you know, hey, you know, we got to do something about this. So, but like I said, lately, I've just been to the doctors like every week, <laughs> you know, twice a week sometimes. And like I said, I'm not one to be at the doctors all the time. You know, I, guys in my family, you know, we, we really don't go to the doctor. They don't believe in going to the doctor. They're the type of, you know, oh, man, I didn't, if I don't go to the doctor, you know, you know, if I, if I have cancer, if I don't go to the doctor, then, you know, no one's going to know or I don't, I don't have it or something like that. And that's just not the case. You know, you can't be, you can't be in denial about these things, you know? And, um, even though, like I said, I'm, I think I'm healthy, you know? I mean, I like to have a drink here and there and, you know, I partied a lot when I was younger, you know, but since then in the last, like, you know, at least good five, six years, I've slowed down a lot. Um, you know, I'm not like a party animal or nothing like that either. And, uh, for this to happen, you know, at this moment, you know, it's just kind of like a big scare, like, whoa, you know, hold on, you know, because I'm a 40, is everything breaking down now or what? You know, how's this, how's this, how's this happening to me? So, um, you know, just know that if something's wrong, some something, something's broke, you got to fix it. Okay, don't just sit back and wait, <clears throat> you know, don't take other, other people's advice, you know, because some people might say, oh, it's no big deal, or it's this or that, or, you know, try some herbs or something. I mean, come on, man, you know, herbs are cool. I'm, you know, I'm not, I'm not down in that, but you know, if you really want to get better and you have a disease or you have, you know, issue, you know, medicine is the way to go. You know, I mean, that's, that's my belief. You know, like I said, that's just my opinion. And, um, since I've been, you know, some, but then again, some medicines work, some medicines don't, some medicines, you know, have side effects and, you know, I was feeling the side effects of this, which could lead to something else, you know, who knows? I mean, like I said, I won't know until next week. And then once, once we know, you know, I will do a video about that then, then at that time, once I get my results in. So, um, with other than that, I mean, that pretty much sums it up. What's, what's been going on with me and what, you know, me and Z have been dealing with is my health issues here. So, um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope that, uh, you know, I kind of gave you guys a, you know, brief rough, you know, rundown of what's going on with me and, um, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Uh, if you guys have any comments, questions, or anything like that, please leave them down below. You know, we, we go through them all the time. So, uh, other than that, you know, um, enjoy your guys' rest of your weekend and um, have a good night. All right, till then, bye.